Tonight, we have an update on the boaters who were reported missing Tuesday. SNN's Nicole Somavilla joins us live in the newsroom with the latest. Nicole? Thanks, Kelly. Here's what we know right now. The sailboat left Sarasota on Sunday and was headed towards Fort Myers Beach. Ace Kimberly and his three teenage children, Roger, Donnie, and Rebecca, were on board. Now, the family was living on the boat moored in Sarasota. The vessel needed work, which is why the family was headed to Ace's brother in Fort Myers. Ace Kimberly called his brother mid-afternoon Sunday. He and his three children were sailing into six-foot seas on his 29-footer. That was the last conversation between them. Kimberly's brother called the Coast Guard Tuesday and reported the family missing. U.S. Coast Guard Captain Gregory Case called finding a debris field and two kayaks dire. He says air crews made the discovery around 10 Wednesday morning. A fixed-wing aircraft located a debris field. Um, this debris field uh, contained a tarp, some water jugs, six life jackets. The debris field was found 33 miles offshore by Sanibel Island. Kimberly's brother confirmed these items do belong to the family, but whether they have any life jackets on them is unclear. The indications from the brother are that they had at least seven. We found six, and, and they also were reported to have two kayaks that were towing behind them. Boat crews found both kayaks, but still no sign of the Kimberly family. We know that, that we were uh, searching in, in approximately the, the right area, um, and we're continuing to search now, and, and our thoughts and prayers go out to the family. Captain Case says they are in the initial search stages, and they're still treating this as a rescue, not a recovery. We're always hopeful, and we do everything we can for as long as we can, and that's exactly what we're doing. Now we will keep you updated with any new information we receive as the night goes on. Nicole, do we know for sure that he lives in Sarasota? Now, Kelly, what we do know right now is that the family docked their boat in Sarasota, but we have no other information that says he lives here. We have been working with the Herald Tribune to find more information, and right now I'm holding a document here where Ace got a violation for um, traffic and driving back in October of 2015, and in this statement right here it says that he lives in Fort Myers, but that's all the information we have right now. All right, thanks, Nicole.